For the dough, the papas rellena, we're using uh, two pounds of potatoes, which we'll boil and mash, and afterwards we'll add a raw egg. For the filling, we're using half pound of ground beef, one small onion, one jalapeno pepper, two cloves of garlic. Uh, for the spices, we're using one teaspoon of cumin, half teaspoon of paprika, and for the rest of the filling, we have a half cup of raisins that have been hydrated, rehydrated in boiling water, which I'll drain and chop before adding. Uh, six black olives, chopped. Three hard-boiled eggs, chopped. And of course, salt and pepper to taste. Alright, time for the ground beef. And my handy dander, handy dandy ground beef snatcher. All right, the ground beef has been cooking about five minutes. It's pretty much cooked and uh, mashed. Now comes the other spices: the cumin and paprika, and the chopped, drained raisins. We're going to cook that a few seconds just to heat them up and combine the ingredients. And next we're going to deglaze the pan with some white wine, about a quarter cup. We want to cook down any excess liquid. We don't want the filling to be too wet, so we're just going to let this cook down and dry out a little. Afterwards, we'll just add, mix in the rest of the ingredients. We just added the olives. We're going to let that cook for about 30 seconds. Take it off the heat and fold in the hard-boiled egg. The finished filling, we'll add the hard-boiled eggs. Fold that in and uh, add salt and pepper to taste. The potatoes have been drained, and now it's time to mash and make mashed potatoes. The potatoes have been mashed, seasoned with salt and pepper, and allowed to cool somewhat before I added the uh, raw egg. So now that their potatoes are cool, I'm going to add the raw egg, continue mashing and mixing this together. All right, I think we're ready to make uh, papas rellenas. We have uh, the potato mixture or potato dough. It's cooled off. The filling, and we have our frying station set up. We have flour, an egg wash. I seasoned it with a dash of salt and cayenne pepper. And for the final coating before deep frying is uh, breadcrumbs. All right, let's give a shot at making uh, these potato croquettes. I pre-proportioned the dough or the uh, potatoes into six servings. That's what uh, the recipe called for. So let's see how it works out. Basically I'm just mashing them down into a uh, flat pancake. Next I'll add the filling. Let's try a spoonful, and the rest is to try to wrap it around the filling. These are larger than most uh, potato croquettas. Uh, the idea is that these are supposed to look like potatoes, but with a little surprise inside. Alright, the uh, papas rianas are formed. Next comes the deep frying. What I'll do is dip in an egg wash, 
to give a light coating of egg. Hopefully it stays together. And then I'll coat with breadcrumbs. And off to the deep fryer. Oil is about 360. So I just drop them in slowly. Cooking time is about three to five minutes. The finished Papas Riena. To accompany our Papas Riena, we're going to make salsa criolla, uh, which is essentially sliced red onions with a half of a jalapeno, lime juice, one tablespoon of vinegar, and salt and pepper to taste. Okay, the onions have been sliced thinly, salt and pepper has been added, the jalapeno has been chopped. Now I'll add the uh, lime juice, mix, and cover for at least 30 minutes. Allow the flavors to macerate. The finished papas rellena and the salsa criolla.